Hello Unix fans, welcome to our channel. In this video, we're gonna walk you through the design process of X Machine, which lots of friends are interested in. In 2019, we determined the positioning of X Machine through a host of surveys, desktop, simple, modern, consumer grade, for enthusiasts. Then we spent a whole year on structural stacking and selections around the spindle and cradle. While improving the design, we also conducted a large number of algorithm tests striving to find the best solution. In 2020, the three complete initial design plans officially came out. Plan A, helmet style. Plan A is simple, modern, and has excellent ceiling performance. We attempted to use marble material for structural construction verification. It turned out that this scheme has problems such as large size and occupying too much space. Plan B, square style. Plan B is a complete design scheme that perfectly meets the positioning principles. This plan has the following distinctive designs. Side-hung door, rotatable cradle, and high-quality spindle. We've made a physical version of the plan for version verification. It can already meet most of the needs of the enthusiasts. The machined aluminium alloy appearance is modern and exquisite. In addition, the rotatable cradle and the spindle ensure suitable rigidity and accuracy, making it highly suitable for processing lightweight parts. The compact body of this machine meets its design principles of simplicity and aligns with the positioning of its desktop 5-axis mini machine, laying a solid foundation for continuous improvement in the future. However, there are still problems such as poor ceiling, easy deformation, and easy leakage of debris. Plan C, cylindrical style. Plan C adopts the cylindrical structure. This plan has solved the problems existing in Plan A and Plan B. So we selected this highly advantageous solution as the initial version for subsequent optimization iterations. We made further improvements based on Plan C and rolled out version 1 with multiple new and improved functions. The newly added tool change system to select and replace cutting tools according to different processes, achieving machining of workpieces in different processes. The newly added automatic debris removal feature. It's equipped with a sliding door instead of the original side-hung door, a drawer and an external vacuum cleaner, effectively solving the debris problem. Newly added intuitive large screen and designed a thoughtful tilt angle that conformed to ergonomics. Version 1 is equipped with Bluetooth wireless handwheel, more buttons and interfaces for increased convenience. A plastic shell is effectively applied to enhance the aesthetics of the machine. We carried out more improvements to achieve a more harmonious proportion and lower assembly costs. Version 2 features an optimized cradle and adopts the harmonic drive scheme to reduce volume and improve accuracy. We conducted physical verification and found that it has the advantages of excellent rigidity, high reduction ratio, and anti-vibration. The new cast iron base has extremely high rigidity, high temperature, and high pressure adaptability and corrosion resistance. Newly added a tool setting device to prepare for the coming tool replacement. At this point, the prototype has relatively complete functions, which marks a milestone in our research and development process. On the basis of version 2, we brought the following upgrades to version 3 with the goal of reducing the weight, facilitating assembly, and use, etc. Version 3 is designed with much lighter aluminium shell, bed, cradle, and certain accessories, lowering its weight to a large extent. On the side of the machine, the aluminium alloy panel has been replaced by a transparent acrylic one to reduce its weight and for better observing the inner motion of the mechanical parts. Harmonic gearbox inside cradle has been upgraded to direct drive motor designed on our own. Overall, the direct drive motor is able to maintain accurate and steady rotation with even lighter weight and higher precision. A layout of in order, spindle drive, 48 volt drives, power supply from top to bottom, a settled and a cooling system has been introduced for better heat dissipation. The external vacuum cleaner design is eventually removed as a result of structural optimization. 
Due to the slight lacking of Bluetooth wireless handwheel, we embedded it into the front panel to bring a smoother user experience. As the internal layout is basically completed, we set out to build a prototype machine for verification. The prototype machine is built via a metal casting process, delivering much more exquisite surface quality and making its body extremely solid for high accuracy manufacturing. When it comes to the spindle, it features an automatic tool change system and a cooling system, making sure a longer service life and better performance. The C-axis enables highly accurate positioning and strong rigidity thanks to its self-designed direct drive motor. Z-axis also offers a self-developed lead screw motor, guaranteeing faster speed, greater precision and lower noise. After countless rounds of refinement, three major design plans, multiple versions, prototyping verification, version 4, the final version is eventually ready for the market. Taking the user's demand into consideration, we added more control knobs into version 4 and optimized this control panel to provide a more intuitive experience. Screws on the top and beside the transparent window are also improved for aesthetic purpose. At the same time, we are making final detailed adjustment concerning manufacturing, assembly, transportation, etc. before the product launch. Just stay tuned. Unix 5-axis CNC machine features self-designed and manufactured motor, drive, spindle, ATC, software, etc. We're confident that we're going to bring the market a capable and comprehensive 5-axis machine that's gonna satisfy your needs. On the side, we plan to make a set of follow-up videos to walk you through the parts of the machine that may interest you, like the spindle, motor, drive, ATC, etc. Just subscribe to our channel if you're interested, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!